What's going on, YouTube fam? Micah and Arabella shooting another Hi! high adventure video. I have people every week on my channel asking me for tips and tricks and people who have never fished before, people who haven't fished in a long time. So I thought, let's just make this little video. This would be awesome. Just kind of showing people how to get started, how to take your kids out fishing. That's always an awesome thing to do. So, Bella, should we go in and get our first fishing pole ever? Yeah, All right. I'm excited. I know you're excited. We've been talking about this for like a week. So let's go in and get started. All right. Which one do you want, boo? Princess one. 946, pretty cheap. Get these pretty cheap at Walmart. We'll go ahead and get this one right here. Can you hold on to that? All right. Keep a good hold on that, all right? So the other thing about the fishing rods and reel sets is a lot of them come with line already on them, so you don't have to worry about that. That's pretty nice. All right, so we're gonna be going after bluegill today, a great fish to start with for little kids. We're gonna get the smallest hooks we can find. These are size 10 right here. If my camera can zoom in on that. They only have a 50 count, looks like here, because of the virus that's going on. A lot of stores are out of a lot of things, but size 10 bait holder hooks, these are for worms. That'll do just fine. So they've got a little, look see, little bag of bobbers right here. Varying sizes. These are $1.48, super cheap. And it looks like you get about 10 of them in there, so that's perfect. So this power bait is $4.36, pretty cheap. We'll go ahead and grab one of these. Here you go, Bella, what do you think? Should we get a pink one as well? Ooh, yeah. You wanna do a pink one, you hold on to that? There you go. We got a pink and an orange. Let's go grab a can of worms, too. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, you know what? They've got, let's see, red worms right here. Perfect. Do you want to put some worms on a hook? Uh huh. Wow, I'm surprised you said yes to that. Is that chili? Yeah. Perfect. Now, the worms looks like they are $2.74, so pretty cheap as well. So, one of the other things we're going to do today is we're going to do a catch and cook. And you can also get those items right here at Walmart as well. So you've got two different kinds. That's $18.72. Or oh, you can get a little bit smaller one, a little bit more compact. We're going to be using this one today because we're going to hopefully be cooking some bluegill up as we catch them. Also, if you want a pan, they have these nice little portable pans. They're $6.83. This handle actually folds into the pan itself. So it's good for, uh, good for traveling around. See, so that just folds right in, makes it nice and portable. Again, 683, nice and cheap. Get that for a little cooking action. Hooks. Bobbers. All right, so there's our grand total. Not bad at all. Let's get out to the lake. What do you say? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so we're at the fishing hole, just a little park here. Let's go ahead and get this taken out first. All right, so I got a little tab here. You just click down on that. You can pull some line out. Get yourself a good pair of pliers or just a decent pair you don't need to go crazy on the old pliers help get the hook out of the fish's mouth and tie and stuff like that I know you're ready sorry let me get you all tied up let's tie our hook on first now that we have our hook tied on we're gonna go up about 10 to 12 inches or so maybe about 10 inches and we're gonna just add a little split shot now I didn't buy any split shots there uh, because they didn't have any D during the pandemic a lot of places are out of stuff right now but you should be able to shop around and find some but these little split shots they just go right on the line and then you just take your pliers and you clamp it down when I was younger I did it with my teeth all the time probably not the best idea but I still have all my teeth so that's good so we're gonna go up maybe about a foot and we're gonna add one of these bobbers and there we go there we have it that is our setup right there a little bluegill setup for a child, for a kid. Where did my child go? Right you're not. <laughs> you ready to go? I've got you rigged up. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Good manners. Let's go down and get you fishing. Oh, oh, oh. So where, it's a stick. Yeah, it's a stick. Good thing we got that stick. Uh -oh. All right. <laughs> All right. You. Uh, we got to go fishing at some point today. Let's go. Look at it. Yeah, it's a little creek. All right, Miss Distracted, let's keep going this way. What is, what you looking at, boo? Oh, grasshopper? Well, let's come this way. That way we get in the water here. Hey, this looks like a good spot. Let's start here. What do you say? There's a little bubble in water. That's a good sign, usually. All right, this is a good place to get set. Oh, well, let's not throw rocks in. You're going to scare the fish away, you goober. 
We can't throw stuff in the water or else the fish will run away. Up, what? What did I just say about throwing stuff in the water, you nut? There we go, there's a little wormy. Now we don't want to use the whole worm because the bluegill won't be able to eat the whole thing. But So we're gonna just pinch a little bit off, okay? Okay. So about like that much, beep, right there. So we're gonna take our tiny bit of worm, put it on our tiny hook. All right, remember how we do this? Mm -hmm. Hand right there, other thumb right there. Oh, oh, hold up, I'm hooked on the weeds right there. Oh, there we go. All right, other thumb right up here. No, no, no. That's when we hold it after we've cast it. Remember, both hands on the rod when we cast it. Put your, pu push your thumb down on this. Hold it down. Bring it back. And away it goes. There we go. All right, now watch that bobber, okay? Okay. Keep an eye on that bobber. A butterfly coming out. Oh, you see a butterfly? It's coming out. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, baby, you just got a bite. You just got a bite. You got to keep an eye on that bobber. Hold it, hold it. Now what? See, see it? See it? All right, start reeling. Start reeling. Reel, 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 reel. Oh, oh no, hold on. One second. One second. Now, what we're going to do next time is we're going to reel and we're going to jerk, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, so put your hand on this. Okay, wait for it. Reel up, reel up. Uh, oh, whoa, that was a big hit. All right, reel, reel, reel. You got him. You got him. Now reel. Reel, reel, reel. Reel hard. Do you feel him on there? Do you feel him on there? You got him. Look at that. Keep reeling, baby. Do you feel him fighting? Keep reeling him up. Reel him up. There you go. Look at that. Oh, oh no. There we go. Oh my, my God. First fish. Your first fish. Look at you. My fish. That's yours, baby. Good job. This is a little bit small to eat. Should we let this one go see if we get a bigger one and we can eat a bigger one? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you want me to let him go? Yeah. That might be a little bit difficult. I'll let him go. Arabella's first bluegill. Congratulations, baby. Was that pretty fun? Mm -hmm. All right. What's his name? Bluegill. Okay, that's a great name for a bluegill. Bluegill. All right, Mr. Bluegill. Time to swim free. There he goes. Bella, good job. Let's go get another one. How about it? All right, now we'll grab onto this. Oh, see, we're getting a bite. I'm going to show you how to jerk the rod, okay? Getting a bite. Wait for it. Reel up some of the slack. All right, wait for it. Wait for it. Jerk. Oh, we just missed it. So see how you feel that? You see how you jerk back? That's what we do. Oh, see, we're getting a bite again. Oh, hold up. Look, now reel up the slack. Wait for him. Wait for him. And jerk. I think we got him. Reel, 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 reel. You feel that? Stand up, stand up. You got him. You got him. Reel him in. Yeah, <laughs> that's the second fish. Get him in. Bring him up on shore. Yeah. <laughs> Woohoo. Yeah, he bit good, didn't he? He's a big one. Good job, baby girl. Look at you. Should we put him in the water? Uh, here we go. We'll toss him in. Woo. Nice job, Knuckles. Okay, so we're about 10 minutes in and we're starting to lose interest because we're three years old. So then you just got to take charge. Go ahead and cast out ourselves here. What we'll probably do is just set the hook, load one on for her and uh, let her reel it in. Hi, baby, you wanna watch? Oh, there goes your bobber. Go, go, reel him in, reel him in. Come on, reel, 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 reel. Hold up, reel, reel. We got one. Do you have him? Do you feel him fighting? Uh-oh, did he get off? Keep reeling. No, you still got him. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at you. All right, let me help you, let me help you. Let's bring him up. Oh, yeah. It's still Look at that. It's still the, it's still one. Yeah. Woohoo! Is this just a big one? Yeah, that's a nice one right there. Good job! Do you want to drop him in? Mm, no, thank you. Okay, all right, we'll drop him in. There you go. Live for another day, Mr. Bluegill. Well, maybe. Hold up. There we go. Good job, that's number three, Bella. Okay, so I'm pretty proud that she actually paid attention long enough for three fish. Because now, what are we doing? Oh boy. Yeah, so, you know, three years old, I really can't blame her. Now I just look like a goober to everybody else. I'm sitting here with a $10 princess fishing rod. People are walking by like, man, let your kid fish. What are you doing? It's like, no, seriously, I was letting her fish. Uh, she just got distracted. Would you stop throwing stuff in the water? Good night. You cheeky thing. I put one on there. Oh, is your bobber moving? 
Real, 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 real. You got him? Yeah. All right. Just hook a fish up on there for him. Hand him the rod, let him reel it in. A piggy? Oh my goodness. It is a piggy. Put him up. Yeah, look at you. Whoa, whoa. Oh, she fell over. It was so big. Look at you. I tell you what, should we release this one? Mm -hmm. Let's let's take off the hook and we'll release him. Yeah, but all right, Bella, what do we have? Look at that. One, two, three, four, five bluegill. You did a really good job for your first time. Should we cook that one up right there? I think that's the biggest one. You want to try eating bluegill? Let's do it. All right, so to clean our bluegill, we're just going to cut down the vent right there. We'll just cut all the way up, and we'll take the head off, and that's just the quickest way to clean them. And just toss them right in the pan with some seasonings and butter. And just like that, see, we just cut up from the vent. Heads off. All the guts are out from the inside there. Ready to go on our pan. There's our little cooking setup. Like I said, super portable. This is really nice to have with you. Let's taste a little bluegill. Okay, after touching the wet fish, we decided, no, we didn't want to do that. Yeah, you're definitely your mama's girl. So we'll go ahead and just drop them in just like that. Yeah, now we're cooking, Bella. Now, I had a subscriber send me some Johnny Seafood Seasoning, and this stuff is bomb. So we're going to go ahead and put some of this on the bluegill. So we've gone ahead and seasoned both sides. There are scales on these guys, so what I just do is cook it long enough to where then I can just peel the skin right off. That's the bluegill, you noodle. You want to try eating some? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's give it a try. But anyway, you can descale them, but when it's kind of this small, um, I just go ahead and peel the skin off. All right, Bella. Should we eat some of your spoils here? You're not going to try any bluegill. <laughs> Are you fronting me, Holmes? <laughs> Come over here and let's have a bite. Fresh bluegill right out of a dirty pond. Doesn't get much better than this. There it is, right there. Fresh bluegill. Oh, it's so good. All right, little baby bite. That's your fresh fish, your first ever that you caught. No, come here. There's the bite. There it is, there you go. What do you think? She's thinking, she's thinking. Yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it? No, I think you love that. You just don't want to say, because you're being a stinker right now. All right, guys, so I had a feeling that little Miss Tootles back there wouldn't appreciate the fresh caught fish. So, being the heady dad that I am, I knew I needed to call an audible right at the last minute, so. Thank you. All right. Look at that. You're in business, baby girl. Here's that for you. Awesome. Thank you. Here you go. This is the audible right here. This is why they invented McDonald's right here for the win. Here you go, baby girl. What do you think about that? Pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I know it's pretty good. Hey, Papa. What hey, you look. get? Did you get a toy? Yeah. Oh. We're golden. We're golden now. It's a toy. For the win. YouTube fam, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, I will see you in the next one.